or call toll-free 888-253-3139. Man, when I get home from work, all Betty does is watch her reality TV and then she goes to sleep. I could take her on romantic dates, I get her flowers, you name it. She's just not the woman I married. Oh, Ralph, that's just awful. Does this seem familiar? Are the honeymoon days of your relationship long gone? If so, consider this. The abundance of chemical additives, pesticides, BPA containers, contaminated tap water, and other toxic substances found in our environment. Experts know our bodies are suffering and being thrown off balance, especially when it comes to your natural systems. Forget synthetic chemicals. Super Female Vitality brings forward key herbs specifically chosen for women's biology without the use of phony additives. Get your bottle of Super Female Vitality today at InfoWarsLife.com, InfoWarsStore.com, or call 1-888-253-3139. InfoWarsLife.com. Live life healthy. Hi, I'm Dr. Edward Group. It took me 20 years of searching the globe to find the deposit of the highest purity iodine available. The new Survival Shield X2 is mined from 7 to 10,000 feet below the earth in pristine, environmentally clean conditions. The iodine crystals we use are extracted from an ancient 300 million plus year old deposit deep in the earth. It's the strongest nascent iodine on the market today. It delivers 650 micrograms per drop. Experience the new formula. Experience the ancient purity. Shield your family. Survival Shield X2, available now at InfoWarsLife.com. X2 from InfoWarsLife.com or call toll free 888-253-3139. Coast to Coast, direct from Austin. You're listening to the Alex Jones Broadcasting Network. Network. Father's Day. Where's my cake, Crashing through the lies and disinformation. It's Alex Jones on the GCN Radio Network. So part of it is we have to break through our kind of private idea that kids belong to their parents or kids belong to their families and recognize that kids belong to whole communities. Once it's everybody's responsibility and not just the households, then we start making better investments. Well, when they say community, they mean the state-run system. That's MSNBC promo. Contrast that with Ron Paul. I mean, most academics were communists. But then they're financed by big mega bankers. Why is that? Because the big ultra-rich know they're exempt from it. They're going to sit offshore while we're in this hell. I'm pretty proud of this Sunday show we've done so far. I like the magazine format we do every other week or so now. I'm tempted to go pure magazine format where we just hardcore interviews, guest, you know, part of it live, part of it taped interviews because I'm getting a lot of great reviews off what we've been doing with the Sunday show. Tell us what you think uh, by tweeting uh, back at me at Real Alex Jones on Twitter or at InfoWars. Uh, I'm going to just conclude with the last seven minutes of this Ron Paul interview with Kit Daniels where they get into some more international issues, Ukraine and a lot more. But before I go any further, you get a great curriculum, even to supplement private school or public school kids with a state-run education, getting the Ron Paul curriculum. It covers liberty, responsibility, standards, self-discipline, success. And you explain to your children, the system doesn't want you to see this. They want you to believe two plus two equals five and that Barack Obama's your daddy, not your daddy. On this Father's Day, I want to declare our children are ours, not the states. I know that's radical. This is radical as saying women have breast, you know, to breastfeed. Everybody knows they're supposed to drink corn syrup and be brain damaged, uh, you know, with the formula. But being serious, you can go to schoolof1776.com. That's the direct sublink that takes you right to Ron Paul's curriculum site where you can read all about it and get the first five grades free or sign up and get it all at one time. And it's just revolutionary to take our children back, regardless if they say Michelle Obama tells our kids what to eat and she says we can't say the word bossy and peanut butter and jelly sandwiches upset Hispanic children. Whoever said that? Well, the media did, to create division, to create infighting. 
No, you decide how you want to raise your kids. Whatever it is you want to teach them, you're their parents. They are your genetic cross clone with you and your wife, you and your husband on this Father's Day. I will declare heresy and say that humans are individuals and free and fathers and mothers are the authors with God of the children, not the abominable state. And I desecrate the God of the state. I spit on the God of the state. Quite frankly, I urinate on the God of the state. I desecrate you. I love the God of the universe, Jesus Christ, not the God of Hitler and Stalin and Mao and Genghis Khan and Julius Caesar. As far as I'm concerned, the God of the state can go to hell. We end this transmission with the conclusion of Ron Paul, but check out schoolof1776.com and deprogram your children today. Uh, I thought the greatest event of the 20th century, politically speaking, was the failure of the Soviet system, the collapse and the breaking up of that and the secession of 12, 13 republics from this uh, domination of, of the Soviets. And uh, because it failed, communism failed, although how many intellectuals in this country cheered it on? They cheered on communism, and uh, of course there were some that were cheering on fascism fascism and communism and now welfareism and Keynesianism that preaches spending is good, deficits don't matter, print the money when you need it, have central economic planning, have the government control our education, take over medical care. It's not the old fashioned type of socialism, but it's an interventionism that pretends that's a little bit freer than fascism, but the failure always comes and that's what we're witnessing right now. So we have the vehicle to get the information out. At the same time, everybody knows there's something seriously wrong and people are very frightened and concerned. So the job of us who believe in the alternative are obligated to prevent the alternative because this system is going to collapse and, uh, and we're witnessing that. So what has to be done is they have to be offered an alternative and fortunately it's a wonderful, uh, it's a wonderful alternative and that is the concept of liberty which is progressing in understanding. You mentioned the Federal Reserve in the monetary system today, we have a much better understanding of how a gold standard would work than, in, than we did in our early history because back then they had things like bimetallism and they allowed states still to expand credit. So there's things that we're advancing on. Even the concept of liberty has advanced though. You don't need governments uh, to preach to individuals on how they want supposed to run their personal lives and what their habits should be. So we're making these advancements, but but the conflict is there and the challenge is here, there. And those individuals who wield the power will not give it up easily. So uh, it's going to be a struggle for the next decade or two. And do you feel that the struggle between homeschoolers and proponents of government education is a microcosm of the struggle between individualism and collectivism? There, there's no doubt about it because you have the collectivist notion about education and the individual notions about homeschooling. One goal that I had on the homeschooling uh, proposals that I have is, is the, the system I have is designed to understand liberty. It's not a homeschooling program which is evangelical and, and, and directed to one place. But I'm not opposed to any of that. But if people understand what I'm talking about, it legalizes and encourages all varieties of homeschooling. So you might have a very secular, you might have a religious one, but mine is designed to say that what we need is liberty. And uh, then uh, people will have, have more options. But I think that uh, it, is, it is a conflict between the two, the state uh, versus the volunteerism. And I think education is a perfect example. That you, can, you can find that in medicine as well, in spite of all that what the government's done. There are still private sources of medical care in this country that are delivering medical care uh, very cheaply and, uh, and, and with high quality. So this is what's happening in education too because it's, it's not like you have to be super wealthy to homeschool your kids. You need ed dedication and effort and encouragement, but you don't need a whole lot of money. Uh, I mean, the rich you take, send their kids to very, very wealthy private schools and of course that doesn't guarantee them a better education they i think the people that go to uh if they get in the right homeschooling program they're going to get a better education than the very wealthy do by sending them to very rich private schools and lastly could you describe your homeschool curriculum and also at what point of your career did you decide to pursue your curriculum well i've thought about education as a uh, goal 
for a long, long time, and even the years I spent in government, I was never thinking first. I always thought of myself as a physician that took a break to uh, talk about things I thought were important. Education was uh, most important to me. I don't believe the politicians have much control of anything. Ideas have, have controls, and that is why I have my own free foundation, uh, and that is why I support the Mises Institute. and. As education, Nixon once said, well, we're all Keynesians now. Well, I'd like to see the day when we say we're all Austrian economists now and understand it in a different factor. So my motivation has always been there. And, of course, in talking with uh, Gary North and Tom Woods, who are our principals in the homeschooling curriculum, uh, they, they helped me design this and devise the courses. And the whole goal is to teach the freedom philosophy, which is not available any place else. Very exciting. Like I said earlier. And again, there's a couple minutes on the homeschool, and there's actually like eight or nine minutes left on geopolitical. We're just out of time. The full video is up on Infowars.com right now. It just got posted where you can hear it, and, and it is a revolution because homeschooling is either evangelical Christian or Christian or it's secular. This is about, hey, liberty, freedom, libertarian ideas, and then you can do whatever you want. And it really is. The curriculum's amazing. I've been into it even before it came out because I got advanced copies of it. Uh, it's very sophisticated, but also very simple at the same time. I mean, that, that's what's hard, is to build something simple and elegant that really works well. This is tailor-made to deprogram your children. Uh, I've had so many cousins that were properly homeschooled, and they ended up getting better scholarships than everybody else that went to the finest schools. Uh, Homeschooling is not for everybody, but this is, great. this is certainly a supplement for anyone on top of the regular educational system. Schoolof1776.com. That takes you to the direct subpage of Ron Paul's curriculum website where you can get the discount, get the first five grades free. Schoolof1776.com or follow the link posted at the bottom of the front page of Infowars.com. Wow. That was a jam-packed transmission. If you just tuned in to this Sunday radio show, it's also a TV show. We stream live video at Infowars.com forward slash show or Prison Planet. Dot TV. We have a nightly news show, weekdays at 7 o'clock, the weekday show, 11 a.m. to 2 p.m., and, and almost all of it is public on AM and FM dial or in video streams. The films, the nightly news, a subscription at prisonplanet.tv. But everything you heard or saw here today will be posted by tomorrow, including the whole radio slash TV show, for radio listeners at infowars.com and prisonplanet.com. We post it all to YouTube a day later so everybody can see it for free instead of having to subscribe. Subscribers help pay it forward and fund the whole operation. I salute you. From the water table to our soils to the atmosphere itself, our world is becoming more and more toxic each and every day. But it's not just the air outside that's toxic. Indoor air has been shown to have two to five times higher concentrations of pollutants than even outdoor air. And most Americans spend 90% of their time inside using toxic chemicals within their homes. There are more than 42 million smokers in the United States. Well over a thousand types of mold and mildew linked to numerous conditions. And don't forget the fact that six million Americans live with pets they're allergic to as well. When I began to research these statistics, it was clear to me it was time to start cleansing my lungs in order to combat the toxic environment that we cannot escape but that we can fight back against. Made with organic and wild cultivated herbs and manufactured in the USA, the new InfoWars Life Lung Cleanse is here in a convenient spray bottle that can be brought with you throughout any toxic environment. Now available exclusively at InfoWarsLife.com or by calling toll-free 888-253-3139. General, what do you think about the FBI saying that there was a terror alert on Monday about a potential Fort Hood situation? The police are shoving people, shoving Alex, shoving the crowd. Here we go, folks. I'm being assaulted. Whether it's the radio show, the news websites, documentary films, or the nightly news, InfoWars is the tip of the spear. Is this another false flag stage attack to take our civil liberties and put more homeland security by sticking their hands down on the pants on the streets? It's up to us to set brush fires in the minds of men and women everywhere. And that's what PrisonPlanet.tv is doing designed to do. You watch the Assad regime is going to be blamed or accused of using chemical weapons against the so-called rebels. What we see now is a war against reality. It's a war against the truth. It's more vital than ever that supporters of freedom become members of PrisonPlanet.tv and share their membership with up to 11 friends and family. Visit InfoWarsNews.com today. Become a member, share your membership, and help take the InfoWar to the next level. Coast to coast.
Direct from Austin, you're 